Our channel believes Zimbabweans are capable of spearheading game-changing, first-of-its-kind innovations that challenge the world's traditional ways of doing things. In the heart of Southern Africa, Zimbabwe has long been celebrated for its rich cultural heritage and resilient spirit. Recently, the nation found itself at the epicenter of a technological maelstrom courtesy of Maxwell Sanangulani Chicken Butso, a self-taught inventor whose audacious claims have both inspired and ignited debate across the globe. Before we start, smash the like and subscribe buttons for more updates. Chicken Butso's announcement was nothing short of revolutionary. He professed to have developed a self-powered electric vehicle, the SCTF FEV which operates without the need for traditional fuel sources or external charging. This vehicle, he asserted, harnesses ambient radio frequencies, converting them into usable energy, thereby offering an infinite driving range without emissions. Such a breakthrough, if validated, could redefine the paradigms of energy consumption and transportation. The SCTFE's design is both sleek and modern, embodying the aesthetics of contemporary automotive engineering. Its purported capabilities include a top speed of 220 km per hour and advanced features like autonomous parking and sophisticated driver assistance systems. The vehicle's energy system, described as a microsci device, is said to convert naturally occurring radio frequencies into pure energy, providing a continuous power source. This innovation promises not only environmental benefits but also significant economic advantages, with an estimated manufacturing cost of approximately $14,000 per unit, making it an accessible option for a broad consumer base. The unveiling of this vehicle garnered significant attention, culminating in a presentation to Zimbabwean President Emerson Manungagwa at the State House in Harare. During this event, Chicken Butso showcased the SCT-FEV alongside other innovations, including a self-powered motorbike and a portable power generator. President Manungagwa lauded these developments as emblematic of Zimbabwean ingenuity and emphasized the importance of nurturing homegrown talent to drive national development. However, the global scientific community has approached Chicken Butso's claims with a healthy dose of skepticism. The concept of extracting usable energy from ambient radio frequencies to power a vehicle challenges established principles of physics, particularly the laws of thermodynamics. Critics argue that while energy harvesting from radio waves is feasible for low-power applications, scaling this to meet the substantial energy demands of an electric vehicle remains highly improbable with current technology. Investigations into Chicken Butso's claims have raised further questions. Reports suggest that some of the components presented as proprietary innovations closely resemble commercially available products. For instance, the hypersonic device showcased alongside the SCT-FEV was identified as a brown portable power station, a product available on retail platforms like Amazon. Such findings have led to allegations that Chicken Butso's inventions may involve rebranding existing technologies rather than introducing groundbreaking advancements. Despite these controversies, Chicken Butso's narrative has struck a chord, particularly within African communities, where his story is seen as a testament to the continent's potential for innovation. His journey from a self-taught engineer to an inventor claiming world-changing technologies resonates with aspirations for self-sufficiency and technological advancement. The Zimbabwean government's interest in establishing a manufacturing plant for the SCTF FEV underscores a desire to position the nation as a leader in innovative energy solutions. The media's role in amplifying Chicken Butso's story has been significant. Various outlets have portrayed him as a visionary, challenging global tech giants with headlines suggesting that his inventions could render traditional automotive technologies obsolete. This narrative has been further fueled by social media, where discussions about his work have gone viral, reflecting a blend of admiration, hope, and skepticism. As the world awaits further developments, the discourse surrounding Chicken Butso's claims serves as a microcosm of the broader challenges faced by innovators proposing disruptive technologies. The balance between fostering innovation and ensuring rigorous validation is delicate. While the allure of a self-powered vehicle is undeniable, 
the scientific community emphasizes the necessity of empirical evidence and peer-reviewed research to substantiate such extraordinary claims. Maxwell Chicken Butso's announcement has undeniably captured global attention, igniting discussions about the future of energy and transportation. Whether his claims withstand scientific scrutiny remains to be seen. Nonetheless, his story highlights the enduring human quest for innovation and the complex interplay between aspiration, skepticism, and the pursuit of knowledge. Maxwell Sangiolani Chicken Butso's recent unveiling of a self-powered electric vehicle has ignited a whirlwind of discussions, debates, and controversies both within Zimbabwe and on the global stage. While his claims have been met with enthusiasm by some, they have also attracted significant skepticism and scrutiny from various quarters. On January 29, 2025, Chicken Butso presented his innovations, including the SCTFE, a vehicle he claimed to be powered entirely by radio frequencies, to President Emerson Manungugwa at the State House in Harare. This event was widely covered by state media, portraying it as a monumental leap in technological advancement for Zimbabwe. The president himself lauded the invention, emphasizing its potential to position Zimbabwe as a leader in innovative energy solutions. However, the initial euphoria was short-lived. Soon after the presentation, a wave of skepticism emerged, primarily from the scientific community and investigative journalists. Critics began to question the authenticity of Chicken Butso's claims, leading to a deeper investigation into the matter. Prominent Zimbabwean journalist Hope Walchino conducted a reverse image search of the hypersonic energy device showcased by Chicken Butso. His investigation revealed that the device closely resembled a commercially available product, the Brown Portable Power Station, which retails for approximately $19 on platforms like Amazon. Chino accused Chicken Butso of deceiving the president and the nation by presenting an existing product as his own invention. These measurements have revealed a complex and dynamic interstellar medium, challenging previous assumptions about the void between solar systems. Voyager 2 sensors have revealed that, even in the farthest reaches of a galaxy, space is teeming with subtle activity. However, the spacecraft's journey has not been without its obstacles. As it moves further from Earth, its signals weaken, demanding cutting-edge technology and resourcefulness to sustain communication. It now takes more than 18 hours for a signal to reach Earth, underscoring the immense distance it has covered. The mission team has worked relentlessly to keep Voyager 2 functional, overcoming challenges like hardware limitations and the harsh effects of deep space radiation. Every message received is a testament to human perseverance, reminding us of our relentless drive to explore the unknown. Despite the spacecraft's dwindling power, the data it continues to send offers invaluable insights, advancing our understanding of the universe in ways we once thought impossible. Voyager 2's pioneering journey has paved the way for a new era of space exploration. Its findings have informed the design of modern telescopes and spacecraft, enabling humanity to dream even bigger. The data from Voyager 2 has inspired missions to icy moons where subsurface oceans may harbor life. It has also influenced the study of exoplanets, guiding scientists in their search for habitable worlds beyond our solar system. Though Voyager 2's mission will one day end, its legacy will endure, serving as a foundation for the next generation of explorers who will continue to push the limits of what we can achieve. Voyager 2's last transmissions brought some of the most breathtakingly beautiful images ever captured, pictures of the outer reaches of our solar system and the soft light of distant stars. These images are a final gift from a spacecraft that has journeyed farther than any other human-made object in existence. They offer a powerful reminder of the immense scale of space and humanity's small yet meaningful place within it. These final views reflect both how far we've come and how much more is yet to explore. Voyager 2's mission is a story of human ingenuity, perseverance, and the unyielding desire to explore. Over four decades, this small spacecraft has traveled farther than we ever imagined, uncovering secrets of the solar system and venturing into the vast unknown of interstellar space. 
As its power diminishes, Voyager 2 continues to send back faint whispers of data, a final echo of its monumental journey. While Voyager the 2nd of May eventually fade into silence, the mark it leaves will echo throughout time, a beacon of hope, inspiration, and the enduring potential of human exploration in the infinite expanse of space.